Welcome to this Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, to um, there, there, I've been actually asked to talk about this and give my personal info on how to use it and um, why you know it could be useful and I'm talking about sharing internet access with other devices but through your Windows 10 PC. Now there is something that you can do when somebody comes over. It happens to all of us. Uh, what happens is that they'll get to a point where they're going to say, I would like to connect to your Wi-Fi. And, of course, you know, if you really know well people, if it's your own family and so on, usually it isn't that much of a problem. But, you know, you might want to keep your Wi-Fi password secret. So is there an option when you have a Windows PC that could be useful to share and mean that you can turn on or off easily if you want to without sharing your main Wi-Fi password. Well, yes, you can create a hotspot with your Windows PC as long as, of course, as you're using and it has available a Wi-Fi adapter. So. To do this in Windows 10, you simply right-click on your um, Wi-Fi internet access and open network and internet settings. You can also go into the settings app and go into network and internet uh, on, on that app. On the left side, you'll see something called Mobile Hotspot. When you click here, it's going to show you a little um, detail of your Wi-Fi connection, so sharing through what? You can share through Wi-Fi, you can share through Bluetooth in some cases. Um, I prefer Wi-Fi, but that all other option of Bluetooth is also available if needed. So the device is, of course, um, you can edit the information here. So you can say, I'm editing, I'm gonna give it a specific name, I'm gonna give it a specific password, and then I'm going to select which bands, 2.45 or any available. And once that is done and you're satisfied, you can click Save. What's nice with the Windows hotspot is that you're in total control of turning it on or off only when needed. And not even, you know, you don't have to give your main Wi-Fi password, which is really nice. So once that is done, if somebody comes over, wants to have access to Wi-Fi, you turn it off, you turn it on, and here it's going to actually be active. So on any device that you have, or that maybe your friends have and want to share, want to actually connect, all they'll have to do is connect, find a network name that you gave, like in my case here is Windows 11 Dev, and you will actually uh, not only do that, but also give them the password. And the beauty of it all is that when you don't want that connection to be done anymore, you can, of course, turn off the mobile hotspot, and it turns off the Internet, and that's it. And, of course, it's going to show you, as in this case here, you see that my phone, my S22 Ultra, is just connected through this connection, and you should have a working Wi-Fi. Now, depending on the computer you have, the distance of the Wi-Fi can vary, but at least, you know, you'll have some Wi-Fi available for your devices through your PC without uh, really having to give any details of your own Wi-Fi uh, router password and stuff like that. And of course, once uh, they're gone, they will disappear from the list because it's only local Wi-Fi through your, in your home basically, or near your home. And when you don't need it, you can actually turn it off, which is sweet because it's an easy way to give access. Now, um, should you have a strong password? You probably should, but because this is a on-off situation, meaning you can keep it off when you don't use it, it's not that much of a problem as long as you don't you know, share with too many people. And make sure that you don't share the same password as your main Wi-Fi because that could be a problem. So uh, that's an easy way to do a mobile hotspot from your own PC and share it with friends or family. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.